So we are in a kind of a lucky business where we were able to transition to online Zoom lessons um, almost immediately. And we've really had no interruption in our service whatsoever. Um, we're offering mini camps and all sorts of online offers uh, for people. We're starting to just now uh, look into doing uh, in-person things, but the online has been great for us. It's definitely a little trickier with the younger age. Uh, the younger they are, the harder it is to keep them focused, specifically on a screen. Uh, it's caused us to, to learn to teach in a different way. Um, all of this is, is great for us to learn and to expand our knowledge. And you know, I think we all have a little bit more resources now when we are approaching students of all ages. Now, the other teachers, are they working from their homes or do they come in here or what do they do? A little bit of a mix. Um, the studio is available to people if they want to come in. So in general, there's always somebody here, you know, two or three times a week in case somebody wanted to stop by. But um, I think there's only two teachers that prefer to teach here, drums, mostly that kind of thing. Uh, but most people are teaching from their houses. Mm -hmm. So our summer season is, um, is always going to be a little bit different. It's kind of more dominated by keeping kids interested rather than, uh, you know, keeping them on a consistent educational role. So um, we've been doing these mini camps, which are virtual, an hour and a half Zoom kind of class with uh, an intermix of private lessons. Um, we are offering in-person rock band camps where we're going to separate people using hula hoops and we're going to use outdoor spaces. Um, we're really doing a lot right now. Actually, I think probably more than we've ever done. Um, we're open-minded and we're pretty much keeping uh, keeping our eyes open for whatever anybody wants to do. If it works for us and it makes sense, we're, we want to keep people playing music. But mm -hmm. I've had students, my oldest student was uh, 89 years old, so mm -hmm. I taught him to play trumpet. He had never played it in his entire life and I always wanted to. And um, yeah, so I mean, you can start at any age. We monitor the lessons to make sure that there's no issues going on. Mm -hmm. um, and just to make sure that everything's running smoothly, people show up on time and that type of thing. Mm -hmm. uh, so I always have a few screens going in the background. Uh, it allows me to, to do that and I get to practice while I'm doing it, which is awesome. Sometimes uh, we're not listening to the lessons, so if there's music on the screen, sometimes I'll try to play along to see if I can <laughs> figure out where they are and that kind of stuff. We do lessons for all ages. We're open all the time. We're, we're really flexible and uh, we have teachers um, always available. So if you're interested in any kind of lessons, feel free to let us know and we'd love to have you.